Welcome back to Our World with Black Enterprise. For Johnny Nunez, the life of a celebrity photographer is all about finding the perfect shot. Paul Carrick Brunson profiles our slice of life. He's one of the most respected names in celebrity photography, but up close and personal, he's also one of the most grounded individuals. Not only does Johnny Nunez remember life before he was given a first chance, but he also remembers life before he was given a last name. I was born and raised in Brooklyn. I was a forced to care child. I was abandoned when I was two years old. Luckily, through the grace of God, Maria Nunez, she was a temporary uh, mother for me. She was like my, my cuddler, so to speak. And she fell in love with me. And by the time I turned five, I was adopted into the Nunez family. My family that adopted me already had uh, four children of their own. They just accepted me. Unfortunately, my mom uh, passed away when I was 10. After losing the only mother he knew, Johnny moved with his new family from Brooklyn to Long Island. He went through all his years of school, graduated college, and was studying to be a radiation therapist. But a series of poor decisions and an expulsion from the program sent his world spinning. It was devastating. Everything I, I, I had, I lost from my friends to even the place I was living, to eventually packing my stuff into a storage unit and living out of my car. I chose that, you know, this is not for me. So I prayed on it, and the answer was photography. With photography as his new passion, it was time to hustle hard and make magic. With his charm and his tenacity, Johnny developed a knack for capturing and even influencing rare yet candid celebrity conversations. It actually was a, a blessing in disguise that led to me doing photography and ultimately being a personal photographer to the likes of some of today's most popular celebrities. Johnny's classic shots include L.A. Reid, Usher, and the legendary Heavy D, Diddy with George Clooney, and hip-hop heavyweights Nas and Jay-Z. His portfolio is a bottomless pool of priceless celebrity moments. Spike Lee, Oprah Winfrey, Nicki Minaj, Beyonce, Alicia Keys, Swiss Beats. I can go on, I mean, Drake, Lil Wayne, being not only their photographer, but being there at the start of their career and also being asked to shoot in the White House for Obama. Just to know I was part of that, it's a, it's a blessing. Today, he's a loving husband and a father, and the superstars he's befriended now show love to his beautiful daughter, Joya, and handsome son, Jeremiah. To, to be number one in anything you, you want in life, you have to be fearless, you have to be tenacious, you have to be patient. Even if the odds are stacked against you, that doesn't apply to you. You have to be able to see and overcome whatever you want, go after it. So I have nothing to lose. I'm taking my camera, it's really my business card. It's really the key that allows me to get into places that the most common people will never ever get to see. If I'm not an example of faith in God, then I don't know what is. That does it for this edition of Our World with Black Enterprise. Be sure to visit us on the web at blackenterprise.com slash ourworld. And don't forget to like us on Facebook at facebook.com slash ourworld with Black Enterprise. Or follow the hashtag ourworldtv. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.